Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be me. Oh shit. Here we go again. Welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a minute, but welcome back. It's your girl, Nisha, and welcome as usual. In today's video, I am going to be showing you uh, what I eat in a week while I do ADF, aka alternate day fastings. I have done this in the past, and some weeks I succeeded, some weeks I didn't, but I'm actually doing a 30-day challenge with a woman named Colleen Marie. Here she is right here. This woman has lost 65 pounds doing ADF and eight months and I want to get back on the bandwagon so this is something you'll be interested in make sure that you give this video a huge thumbs up subscribe to the channel if you're not and let's get into it so I'm actually doing a 30-day challenge where I am doing alternate day fasting basically what alternate day fasting is it's a 36 hour fast one day you're eating one day you're fasting one day you're eating one day you're fasting you just keep going until you reach your goal weight or you make this a lifestyle so she has created a 30 day challenge for us. Today is our feasting day. And yeah guys, um, basically the rules are, um, you are going to take a picture of yourself, which I did, and you are going to show your weight. And after you weigh in on the first day, you will not weigh yourself until the end of the month, which is May uh, 30th. So this challenge is for May. I will be continuing doing this challenge because I have a lot of weight to lose. I'm on a journey to lose a hundred pounds. And yeah, guys, um, she does say that in the second week, you could do a mid weigh in if you want, but basically at the scale, when it comes to weight loss, guys, the scale won't be your enemy. It doesn't detect, you know, if you're bloated, if you had a bowel movement, there's so many things that the scale doesn't, um, take account for so put that skull away after you weigh yourself and you know just eat good make sure you're getting enough calories basically she says if you're somebody that eats 1500 calories like me double your calories because you are eating for two days remember that because the next day you won't be eating so you need to be getting good calories and don't just eat nothing but junk but have a well-balanced um diet and eat really good so when it comes to, down to your fasting days you will be able to survive so like i said i've done this in the past i will link my other videos so if you want to go see that but guys this is day one um i'm getting ready to go to a restaurant i'm actually going to wingstop with my family i know i know i just told you guys to eat right but you know what this is our day one we're gonna be eating good today and i will see y'all guys when we get to wingstop Alrighty guys, so welcome back. It is currently 1 p.m. and this is what I decided to have um, for today. I ended up going to Wingstop as you saw in the last clip and I got me a 10 piece with lemon pepper and original high and I asked for it to be wet and baby, they, they came y'all. Look how juicy these look. Even though they did me wrong on my fries, but it is what it is. This is what I'm gonna be having for my first meal. Um, a tip while you're doing alternate day fasting guys, Make sure you're getting enough calories. I usually eat about 1500 calories. So when you're doing alternate day fasting, you wanna double that. So I'll be trying to have 3000 calories uh, every single day so I can meet my uh, goal in alternate day fasting. Cause I'm letting you guys know I did this in the past and if you're not eating enough, when it comes time for you to fast, you're not gonna make it. So this probably here is about, probably about 2000 calories probably about about 2,000 calories so make sure you get in your uh your calories guys so you can survive um all today fasting i've done this in the past like i said so i'll put like links if you want to see my day one of me doing this but yeah this is what i'm having if i decide to have anything else after this meal i'll probably just have an iced coffee but uh yeah guys i love y'all i'm gonna go ahead and enjoy my that's the lemon pepper Good morning everybody it is currently may 2nd and today is our fasting day so i just woke up and i was getting ready to take my girls to school but they are currently sick so today is going to be quite the trip because i planned on working 
until they got out of school and now I have to stay home and take care of them which is fine but today may be a little hard so as y'all know I am doing ADF for 30 days I don't know if I told you in the beginning but I'm doing a 30 day Colin Marie's uh, challenge I'll link her YouTube in the description but basically this woman has lost over I believe 85 pounds doing ADF within eight months and she just looks incredible and I've done ADF in the past again I'll put uh, old videos down in my uh, description box so y'all can get some more information but today is day two and today is our fasting day so I know that when you start this journey it's gonna be hard in the beginning but you just got to keep yourself busy so today I'm just gonna be taking care of the girls uh, relaxing doing any chores and I think I'm gonna go help on my dad in a little bit but um, just keep yourself busy if you get hungry make sure that you drink plenty of water you can have unsweet tea you can have black coffee just stay away from things that have calories um, you know if you if you miss chewing chew on some ice or some a piece of gum sugar-free gum and you should be fine guys so um, there's not much I'm going to be doing today um, if they were at school, I would take you along my what I do while I the girls are at school because y'all guys know I do Uber and stuff and I would took you along some trips, but there's not much for me to do. I'm just going to be chilling, relaxing, watching some TV and enjoying this beautiful day. Today's our fasting. Allow your body to digest and just have a good day, guys. Um ADF is really not hard. It's just one day you're eating, one day you're fasting. One day you're eating, one day you're fasting. Take it like that and you will succeed. Um, I don't know if I told you this also in the beginning. I am only weighing I only weighing myself uh, once a month. So we did the weigh in. I won't be weighing myself until the end of the month, which is May 3rd, uh, 30th. The reason why, guys, is because... The scale will not be your friend when you're doing ADF because you will lose inches before you lose weight. And if you're constantly weighing yourself, you're going to be getting into your head. You know, one day you might lose weight. The next day you may not. One day you may lose weight. It's just going to mess with your head. And I feel like if I don't weigh myself until the end of the month, we're going to get a bigger number because we're going to we're going to lose weight doing this regardless. So I would put away the scales because the scale is going to be your enemy. That scale is just three numbers. That's all it is. It's just three numbers at a point of time of where you're at. It doesn't define you. It doesn't make you. You know, I struggled a lot with the scale and, you know, I've just come to term with, you know what, that scale is just there just to tell me where I'm at. It doesn't mean that I'm a bad person. It doesn't mean nothing. I'm doing something about my health and that's all that matters. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day two. You could do it. Comment down below if you are on day two with me. And I will see you guys tomorrow for our feasting day. Have a good day. Okay guys, so this is the finished product. I have some blueberry, strawberry, chocolate chip pancakes that I made a little bit of eggs and then I made some coffee so this is what I'm having for my first meal bye, bye. <laughs> so it is currently two o'clock and this is what I'm having for a little snack I decided to make like a little fruit bowl so I have some baby bellas I have some carrots I have some mini pretzels I have some pineapple some strawberries some grapes and some sliced almonds and I'll be drinking my cranberry juice so this is what I'm having for my snack guys mm. it's so good guys so hey everybody welcome back it is currently dinner time and I wanted to show you what I am having for dinner so today I wanted a big juicy salad so I used some romaine lettuce some carrot sticks half a cucumber my favorite peppers in the world, banana peppers. I cut up half of a green onion. I added uh, one whole organic Eevee apple. I have some uh, tomatoes, the grapevine ones. I added a little cheese. And then I added some of this vegan ranch and half avocado. 
and this is what it looks like doesn't look so beautiful and then all I did was top it off with a little bit of pink Himalayan salt and pepper but look at all the colors yes so this is what I'm having for dinner I will see you guys tomorrow for day two Mmm. This is really good, guys. I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish this whole salad, but this is what I'm going to be eating. morning everybody today is day four of us doing ADF and I just wanted to show you a couple things that have been helping me get through my fasting day today's my fasting day I'm currently taking my little girl to school today's her pajama day you know I try to tell her those are not pajamas but you know kids will do what they want to do all right baby and these are some things that I've been using on my fasting days I've been drinking you know flavored water it's zero calories has a little bit of sweetener in it and What's been helping me really get through my day is my uh, Alani's Cherry Slushy Energy Drink. It is 10 calories. I believe uh, Kalani did say you have a 50 calorie uh, maximum because over 50 calories will start breaking your fast. But uh, what, baby? <laughs> so this has just been really helping me get through my fasting days because, you know, I, you can have coffee. But me guys, I know I want to put some cream and sugar in it and I don't want to break my fast. So yeah guys, this is day four. I'm taking the girls to school and then I will just be bringing you along my day of how I get through my fast. So I will see you in a little bit. I'm doing an Instacart right now guys, shopping. All right, just got done shopping this order. It's time to put it in my trunk and deliver. So it is currently 12.37. Uh, PM and I just wanted to show you guys what I got from HEB so I got me of course some uh, some Tylenol some Aleve whatever you want to call it some pain medicine because while you're fasting you may experience a little headache so I got me some you know ID Pro fit to help with my headache um, I got me some more exfoliant this is the one I'm using it's Dove pomegranate seed and Shea Buddy Shea I said Buddy butter and guys this smells so good usually i would use the tree hut but right now here in texas they're about seven to eight dollars so i got this one this one smells super good i love to exfoliate twice a week just to keep my skin nice and soft um i got me some deep cleansing pore strips for my nose because um i started working at amazon um, I've been working there for about a month now guys and Amazon is a very very not hard job but you will be sweating by the time you leave so you know I got me some strips to help clog that area of course I got me uh, some more foundation I like this one um, it's the matte poreless and cappuccino I believe fit me Maybelline and then a new beauty blender this has been what has been helping me on my fast days gum guys you can have gum of course don't swallow it but i've been having a piece uh, a piece or two each day and this has been really helping me you know our mouths crave you know the motion of chewing so this will be a big help i got me some more cotton rounds for when i take off my makeup i need some more deodorant and this is the one i like to use is the secret water lily and argan oil this smells super good i i, I love I love uh, sm um, good smelling uh, deodorants. I got me a new beauty blender because the one I had was old. And guys, I got me some more mouthwash because I'm telling you, you might experience like your tongue turning white and you'll be scrubbing and scrubbing and you know, that's just part of fasting so of course i got me some more mouthwash and i got me some vitamins i really don't know what as a woman i should have so i just got me some hair skin and nails it has collagen gummies and then a multi-vitamin comment down below what vitamins should we take i know i should probably be taking like iron pills because i am uh 
iron, I have an iron deficiency, so I probably need to take iron pills. But my doctor said as long as I eat greens, that should help. So, uh, yeah, guys, I just wanted to show you um, what I got at HEB. You know, just some tips. As y'all saw before, I was working. So, as soon as they drop the girls off, I do have, a, you could say, a second job, a little gig job. I do Instacart, Faber, DoorDash, Ship, you name it. And I would usually do those jobs until it's time to pick up my daughter. I usually pick her up around three. So um, keep yourself busy. What I'm going to be doing now is um, I'm going to put these away and I'm just going to clean up the house. Probably just watch some TV until it's time to pick up my daughter. And then when my sister gets home, I'm going to cook them dinner. Yes, I am a mother. So, of course, I'm going to cook for them. And make them put some spaghetti and garlic bread and some corn. And once they're done, I'm going to take me a shower and then I will be going to sleep. Um, while you're fasting, guys, go to sleep early. Go to sleep early. If you can go to sleep early, go to sleep early because that's going to basically help you time travel to the next day. So those are just my tips. Keep yourself busy. Go to sleep early. Um, make sure you're drinking plenty of water. This is my second bottle. This one is 33 ounces so uh, this is my second one so i've already had like about 69 ounces of water i love flavored water um y'all saw i had an energy drink my alani energy drink i finished that and yeah guys you should be golden if you feel like you're gonna break what i like to watch is Colin marie i will speak to her i will be speaking about this lady all throughout this 30 day challenge because she created it and she's just been a big inspiration on my fasting days I don't know if, if y'all guys know about her. I'll put her link in my description, but comment down below when you are fasting. Do you love watching this woman's fasting video? She gets me through my fast each and every day. So just keep yourself busy, guys. I know we could do it. This is currently day four. I love you guys. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be coming back after today. If I do, it's just a check in, but I know I got this. Um... I think I'm going to go ahead and end day four here, guys. I will see y'all guys tomorrow for our refuel day. Love y'all guys. Okay, guys, and just like that, breakfast is served. Wow, it took no time at all. The fridge toasty sticks just went in the microwave. I made me some eggs, and I just put some Frank's Red Hot Sauce on my eggs because, you know, I like it spicy. And then I have the cranberry juice. That's the, I believe it was a strawberry one. And yeah, guys, this is what I'm having for my first meal today. It looks gorgeous. I can't wait to eat this. And guys, um, again, guys, this is what I'm having for my first meal of the day. And I will see y'all guys late. Welcome back. So it's currently 1.50 p.m. And I'm getting ready to eat lunch. So for today's lunch, I picked up some sushi at HEB. And I will be having the spicy California value pack with my protein shake. Yeah, guys, today was a pretty busy day. I just did uh, some spark driver. That's a little gig act I do while I'm not uh, working at Amazon. And yeah, guys, I got hungry, so I came back because, you know, I got to go pick up my daughter. So, bon appetit. Mm. So good, guys. So, this is what I'm having for my lunch. I will come back to y'all when it's time for dinner time. Alrighty guys, so this is what I'm having for dinner. I decided to do a baked potato and a side salad. In my side salad, I have some crackers, some carrots, cucumber. I added a little bit of tuna with some ranch, salt and pepper. And then my baked potato, I just added some vegan butter, some cheese and sour cream. So this is what I'm having for dinner. I will see y'all guys tomorrow for day six. Good evening, everybody. Today is day six of us doing alternate fasting. I just got done getting dressed for work because your girl 
is going to work. I know I work the night shift. It is currently 8.20 and I need to hurry up so I can get on work on time. But I just want to say I am so proud of you guys for making it this far. We are almost one week in. Let's go. And yes, guys, I just want to tell you guys to keep going. Um, it's currently, what did I say, 8.20, right? So we are almost ready to feast. And guys, I, I don't feel hungry. Uh, when I got off of work, I got off early. Um, I went to bed at 4.30 and I slept until 2. So make sure you're getting your sleep. Yes, sleep is very important. I just bought a, a jug. It's a 64 ounces uh, jug. And I'm literally at the bottom. I've been making these pretty waters. My mom's been following a girl called Tonya Salago. I don't know if I'm saying her name right. But she used to weigh like 485 pounds. She had a weight loss surgery. And now she's like at 2... I think 23 I'm not sure about her weight but she has a TikTok where she makes pretty waters you know water recipes and guys I had uh, one where it was the Skittles original and the pink starburst with water ice in it baby it tastes so good so make sure you're drinking plenty of water like all day after I woke up I've been in the bathroom like all day because I'm drinking a lot of water which is good because we want to make sure that we're flushing out all those toxins so yeah guys I hope that y'all had an amazing day six I hope your fast was amazing tomorrow is our last day which will be our feasting days I will see y'all guys tomorrow I gotta get to work so I love y'all y'all have a wonderful day bye morning everybody we are on day seven of us doing adf i am so proud of us if you are doing this with me i just want to let you guys know that i'm so proud of you we've made it to day seven and i just wanted to show you guys what i'm eating for today as i said in the beginning i am in a challenge with colleen marie in her community we are doing a 30-day challenge which i'm gonna continue to do more than 30 days of course because i have a lot of weight i need to use but this week going forward is all non-scale victories i will not be showing my weight until may 30th only because you know we when you're on a weight loss journey the scale can be uh your worst enemy so as long as you are doing what you're supposed to be doing eating good food fasting when you're supposed to be fasting no cheating there's no need to worry about the scale just by looking at my face my face looks a lot slimmer I don't feel as bloated and I just just feel amazing I just got off of work guys so that's why I kind of look like a little mess but let me show you what I'm having for our first meal today so guys I ended up making some tacos these are some sausage and egg tacos and I just added some cheese and sour cream and I will be drinking my Cran uh, Apple by Ocean Spray. So let's get into these tacos, guys. I'm so hungry. Whew. I just can't believe that I have completed a whole week of ADF with no cheating. I've been dedicated. I have not cheated. And I just feel great about myself, you know. You, you can do it as long as you, you know, stick to it, guys. So bon appetit. Mm. So good. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. So amazing. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish these up, guys. I'm going to go ahead and after I finish this, I'm going to go take a shower and I'm going to go to sleep because I do work again tonight. I work the night shift Wednesday through Saturdays at Amazon from 9 to 6.30 a.m. So um, I'm going to finish this up, take a shower. I'm going to go to sleep and I will come back when it's time for lunch. Love you guys. Hey everybody, so this is going to be my lunch slash dinner for day seven. Oh my god i can't believe we made it a whole week of doing adf for my meal today i decided to go to subway and i basically got the foot long on italian urban cheese and the protein is tuna i added some lettuce tomatoes onions pickles cucumbers and peppers with the italian dressing on it and yes guys i am just so proud of myself 
Um, I just want to let you guys know that I'm proud of you. We did it. And yes, I'm just so blessed for us being able to do a whole week of ADF. So I'm going to eat this and we tomorrow we are going to close out the vlog. I love you guys. I will see y'all guys tomorrow to close it out. Y'all have a wonderful there night. There you have it, guys. We have completed our first week of ADF. I am so proud of you if you made it this far. I can't wait to go into week two, guys. I just feel so excited. I feel so proud because usually when I start something, I never finish it. And I just feel really good about myself. I've noticed some changes and, you know, me putting on some clothes. So I know I've lost some inches. And I just am so excited of starting this 30-day challenge with you. Of course, I am going to be continue to go on because I have a goal in mind. My goal is to get to 140. I feel like that'll be a good weight for me. And yeah, guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Make sure that you give this video a huge thumbs up. Make sure that you also subscribe to the channel if you're not. And I will see you next week for week two. Bye, guys.